Unfortunately, the state of Idaho is ranked 51st out of 50 states in the, in the District of Columbia for the percentage of women over the age of 40 obtaining annual screening mammograms. This is probably due because Idaho is quite a rural state. I see women um, all the time who had missed out on their mammogram for anywhere from one year to even up to 10 years or more. And we think, boy, if you had been going through your screen consistently annually, which is what the recommendations are, we would have found this at a time where we had you know, a much more favorable outcome. I didn't need to talk about chemotherapy. Surgery may have been less. We know that um, because of how geographically spread that we are, that um, it's one of the variables that create a barrier for women to get their screening mammography. And so we wanted to keep the service as community-based as possible. And it's hard enough to just live your life without having to, oh, I have to go do this and do that, and just to have something right there, um, especially in these rural, rural communities where they are so far from everything. I think you need to make getting an annual mammogram a priority in a woman's life. You need to understand that the risk of getting breast cancer if you live to the age of 90 is one out of eight. And knowing that risk should empower you to make the right decision and go out and get your mammogram. We're trying to provide an easier access to that mammogram by our mobile mammography clinic. It's information, it's education, and it's being that women need to know that yes, breast cancer can happen to you even though that Idahoans are tough, it can happen to them too. And we can help this with a mobile mammogram unit. We can get a very needed preventative service out into the communities where people live and we can, I mean, we can save lives.